so what's up everyone welcome back to your channel bright life institute i'm alicia today i want to discuss should you date when you are broke the question the answer to this question will be responded by gender because the issue of dating when you are broke doesn't apply the same to girls and to guys. So let's start with the ladies, shall we? If you are a lady and you are broke, well, the advice is go out there and date. More than likely, you find some very gentleman guy who will not care that you are broke or not. They will just love to have your company and you may really enjoy yourself and this may help you to come out of your issue to be broke whatever the reason why you're broke maybe you recently lost a job maybe you had some change and facing some financial difficulty maybe you had a breakup or maybe you just had a divorce all those change can impact your finance and can leave some of us broke So for the ladies, the challenge is not the same than for the guys. And yes, the ladies, either they are broke, we advise them to go out there and date. Now for the guys, the advice is quite different. If you're a guy and you're broke and you want to go to date, this may be not a good idea at all for you because many girl, many women expect on the first date for the guy to get the bill, for the guy to invite them out. So that is your first date with this girl or your fifth date. You may be you know kind of forced to spend money that you don't have it's either you only spend for you or you spend for the both of you some guy either they broke they want to show off that they are a man and they can pay some guys as well maybe you know because they are broke because they have some financial issue and like anyone, if you don't feel good with yourself, you want to go out there and feel better with yourself. But guys, dating as a guy, when you have some financial issue, maybe not the right you know, action to do. It's maybe not the right activity for you to be involved with because it's going to cost you. It's going to cost you that the girl continue seeing you or not. And think about example if yes you meet a great girl. She had her finance in place. She has a job. She doesn't she's not broke. And every time you are with her that it can be in the restaurant or it can be in her place she's always getting the bill there is a time where she's going to feel like what the hell is this she's going to start feeling resentful and argument going to start to happen because you are not carrying yourself Either you told her that the reason that you are not participating in those financial, you know, 
things that you get involved with together is because you're broke. Uh, this is going to bring some argument. If you are broke as a guy, you should stay home because you're just going to find some problem and showing, you know, a view of yourself to the woman that you want that is not going to be very flattering for you. Now, there are some of those women out there that doesn't mind, you know, they doesn't mind to, you know, get the bill and they want to be understanding. Now, ladies, if you are listening to this, this is an advice for you. A guy that come to your life broke with no money and you are paying, you are carrying him you are supportive toward him yes it's loving it's really loving we know that we would love that for a guy to do that for us but some guys many guys do not see it like that the, the one of the reason they may be dating you is because they could not afford the girl that they want and you are offering them a too good of a ride a free ride where they get food sex company and not putting any effort and so on so you are accepting a low version of them of that guy they know it you also know it despite that you're hoping that if you are there in the hard time of this guy where he was low, where he didn't have money, where he was broke, that you'll be rewarded later by him, by him, when he will get a job, when he will be okay, and when he will make money, that he's also going to be there for you. Two things can happen, because I don't want to say that every woman that take a guy that is broke, that doesn't have money, end up to be left later by this guy once he get himself on his feet because everybody is different we're dealing with human being and human being are complex so yes it can happen like I just mentioned now that a woman that pick up a woman that pick up a broken guy that he can be is broken mentally financially and she's accepting the low version of himself and she's there she's supporting she's getting the bill she's advising him she doesn't mind there is a high chance that later when this guy get himself on his feet feeling like a man he's making the money he is no longer having some mental issue or broken heart issue or financial issue that he will leave her he will leave her because now he feel confident enough to go get the woman or the girl that he really want because now he feel good he feel like he can afford the, this woman or any woman that he really wants so why would he be with you that is the first you know outcome that can happen in that situation the second outcome can be well uh, the, the guy stay is grateful and now he's participating with you uh, and he's also you know he's there for you he's bringing the financing is grateful that you have been a great companion to him let me just quickly say there is also a third option I'm sorry I just thought about it that one So the third option is some woman out there like to pick up broken, useless, uh, mentally useless or mentally weak or broke guy 
in order to feel powerful, to feel power over him. She's looking for a project. It could be uh, she see this man as a child or she see him as, you know, someone that is going to be under her. And once the guy have passed this period and become more solid and now he's participated, so he has not run away, he is there for her. She start to complain that, you know, about the giving that he's doing now. That he's becoming more man. Let's say that this was a guy that was a bit fat, uh, not confident, uh, didn't have a job, and so on and so on. Now he changed. He's a guy that go to the gym, that he got a new job, he got a car. Uh, she's noticing more girl noticing this guy looking at him, but he's not. You know, worry about that is with her but she start to lose her confidence so that also can happen and this third option that can also happen to guy that is dating a girl that didn't have a job that had money problem that she did not feel confident about herself and suddenly she start to go to the gym she start to get a new job she start go to the training she start to go on holiday she start to buy her own home and get uh, a car and now he's freaking out so this situation on the third can happen in both gender so to get back to the subject of this video should you date if you're broke for the ladies yes and no i will suggest the lady to date if it's an issue of you know you don't feel good you feel lonely whatever it is you can still go date as a lady but i also in some time will say to the lady if you're broke take it seriously fix your life before you go to look for a man it's not a good idea to go dating when you have some financial issue in your life if you don't have a job you don't have money you don't know how to pay your rent looking for a date a guy a man to support you is not a good idea if you want to be an independent person an adult uh, a partner of force to the person that you're gonna find because you may attract people that have narcissist personality abuser psychopath because you're vulnerable in that time. You may accept some behavior from the guy that you will not accept if you had a job, all right? Now, uh, for the guy, is definitely do not date if you don't have a job. Um, as a guy, you are expected to spend money and if you don't spend the money and you, um, you know, the girlfriend that you just met um, he's spending the money on you you're not gonna look good on you as a guy you, you're not gonna feel good you're not gonna feel like a man and this is not good this is not a good start so work on yourself fix whatever issue it is uh, that you need to fix with your situation so you can be the great man and the great version of yourself before you go uh, mixing with somebody else Dating is not always great guys You meet a lot of people that have issues, you know, they you know can have mental issues They can be people that want to use you. They can be people that want to abuse you. They can be liar They can be all sorts of uh, things So if you're not in the right place in your life and to be in the right place in your life also include the finance have finance and having our own money is really important to have independent and uh, her self-esteem her feeling good at herself is related to having money security in her life so before you think that what you need is a girlfriend maybe what you guys need girls and boy is not a guy and it's not a girl but is having a life some people when they're in crisis financially 
they are looking for someone because they are not looking for a relationship they are looking for a help so stay away from people that is going to bring problems to your life opt for the option to have a peaceful life um, you know a life that make you happy come with who you mix with all right so guys that is my response to this question today i hope you like the video if you did give a big thumbs up subscribe to the channel comment on the video to share your opinion should you date if you are broke all right i'm alicia this is your channel brighter life institute and thank you so much to have watched this video. I'll see you on the next video. Bye.